back. I am back. Hello. No crossword. All right. Who we got texting me? Ugh. How are you available so much? Can't do Kawakami yet. We can't do, uh, what's her name even if she's there? Hifumi. I think we're going to go hang out with Oya again. I hate it, but, like, there's no one else to hang out with. And I have decided to try to max every confidant in the royal. Are you think interesting lately? I'm expecting a lot from you since you're a true believer. I just need some of your time. I'll even buy you some food. A true believer? What am I? Friggin' uh, the Henry from Once Upon a Time? Really? You have some news? Where do you get these things? You, you believers scare me. I'll see you at the bar in Shinjuku. Let's go. The game is getting revenge on me by only giving me Oya to hang out with. You might be right. A fan site? Oh, you mean the Phantom Aficionado website? I didn't know it was so popular with high school kids. I haven't been paying much attention to it. But if it's newsworthy, I guess I should keep tabs on it. Phantom thieves must be really bored if they're going after small-time criminals now. I have a theory that they're all minors and their leader is some simpleton dying from boredom. Alright, well, you're scum. Shouldn't make assumptions, you dumb idiot. Ha! <laughs> you're right. My theory is definitely half done at best. Plus, if it only takes a second to change a person's heart, they totally wouldn't be bored. Well, I'm not really interested in writing entertainment articles about whatever fads caught on. But they do really well, right? Some journalists who were in here seemed frustrated about that. Journalists? Oh, you mean Nakuo and the others? Shit. You'd really let me in with those hyenas? Ha! Don't insult me. People at work call them paparazzi behind their backs, but me? I'm a real journalist. Yeah, you're worthless. I'm sure you are. Hey, I wasn't looking for some kid to butt in. Entertainment articles are all about selling copies. The truth doesn't even matter. I would argue that almost all media nowadays, the truth doesn't really matter. All that any, like, any media cares about anymore is, is, uh, clicks. But maybe that's just me. Nobody wants to read real news. Maybe you should quit. And, like, move out of this country so I never have to see you again. No, I got my reasons for staying. But at this rate, you... If I quit now, it'd be the same as declaring my partner guilty. Damn it. Jointly responsible. What a joke. She didn't do anything. That's why I can't quit and why I'll never give up. What was she accused of? Has nothing to do with you. Well, then maybe you shouldn't talk about it when we're in the middle of a conversation. But thanks to you, I've had more time to focus on my own investigation. I'm going to write an article that you'll really enjoy. Think of it as a sign of my appreciation. <laughs> I'll never enjoy anything you write. I can see it now. Exclusive behind the incredible Phantom Thieves. Dial 911 for justice. That sounds stupid and you're stupid. Don't worry, I'll take it seriously. After all, that's what I promised you. Just give me my rank up. Shocking scoop. Security level raises slowly and lowers upon defeating an ambushed enemy. Whatever. All right. Security level is never an issue for me. You sure are weird, though, coming all this way to Shinjuku at night? What on earth is that awful ringtone? Hello? Uh-huh. Wait, what? I can talk with them? Really? Okay, I'll be right there. Work? Nah, I'm already off the clock. Sorry, I have some urgent business I need to attend to. Just put this one on my tab, lala -chan. Well then. See ya. Jeez, she's such a child. She gets so excited the moment something comes up about her favorite assignment. Anyway, shouldn't you be getting home too? Hooray for useless charm. Why is Oya so available? You answered your own question. Ah, right, because she has no one that wants to spend time with her. Yeah, it's another thing. Like, hey, you're really weird for coming to this bar. Uh, yeah, you texted me and asked me to come here. Also, yes, we got a seat. Let's go. Go ahead and finish this one. That's two of five books complete. Hmm? Chiefs don't want for themselves, but much is expected of them. Wow. Love the sound of the word chief. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you always say. The only chief is Coffee Daddy. Oh. You finished reading Call Me Chief? Did you want me to call you Chief now? I'm just kidding. Did you learn more about Chiefs and their big hearts? Even in the underworld, there's kindness. Still not ranked up, but that's fine. Coffee Daddy, I'm coming for that rank 5, and then I'm coming to hang out with you again. Hopefully we can get the tower today. We're almost at the station. I'd say that was a good use of your time. Yeah, yeah. To be honest, after watching over 150 episodes of Persona 4 Golden, I feel like the old lady was worse than Oya, but Oya is still bad. I think I might agree with you. Honestly, 
like, I hate both of them. They're my two least favorite, like, they're my least favorite confidants in their respective games. Like, Oya is my least favorite in Persona 5, and then whatever her name was, the death confidant in Persona 4 is my least favorite in Persona 4. I think I might hate death from Persona 4 more than I hate devil from Persona 5, but they're kind of close for me. Autumn is for eating, autumn is for art, autumn is for reading. Stores will use whatever reasons they can to pull in customers, this season in particular. People also say that autumn is for sports. A while back, baseball was the national sport, but these days people have been into soccer. As you know, black and white are the common colors for soccer balls. I remember this question from the OG. Nelan Kruzusan, could you take a look at this picture? Do you know this one? How many white and black shapes are there respectively on a soccer ball? Okay, originally, I'm pretty sure when they asked this question in OG, the question was, why is it black and white? And the answer was like, because it showed up good on TV or something like that. Uh, I have no idea. A 20 white, 12 black. This is it. Precisely. That's correct. This ball is composed of 12 black pentagons and 20 white hexagons. It's made up of a total of 32 surfaces. By the way, apparently soccer balls used to be only one color. They changed it to black and white so it could be seen better on television, on, or so I hear anyway. Television was still in black and white when they started airing soccer in Europe. At any rate, the contrast of white and black next to each other, it's a slick design, don't you think? He's done it. Nice going. He must be really smart to answer that. I am a genius. I'm Eurydite. Recent design that's caused my eye is the Moon Burger, which uses an egg to rep represent the moon words. I'm well aware of the bad rumors surrounding Okumura Foods, but you can't argue with hunger. Mm. Think someone like her really eats hamburgers? Why, why would she not eat hamburgers? What, what are you talking about? What does that mean, cat? Don't want to go to the palace. Oh my goodness, Maruki is like, I guess since we just unlocked hanging out with him again, Maruki is like super like, hey, let's hang out a lot. Futaba is tempting, but I mean, honestly, I'm gonna like hard focus Makoto and Yusuke every time they show up until I max them out. Slyja, thank you for the cheer. So, Maruki, we're gonna get to you. Don't worry, dude. I'm gonna max you out. Honestly, if I can, I'm gonna max you out before we even get to November, so I don't have to worry about it getting close to the, the edge, you know? But, uh, hey, Makoto, you have any plans? Contact me if something comes up. I'll be at school for a while. Let's go rank up Makoto. Kira, couldn't have you decided on our plans for today? Don't you know, Chaos? Teachers don't eat cheeseburgers. I mean, I don't eat cheeseburgers either. I'm not a teacher. Guess if that's really what you want to do. It's part of my grand strategy. Yes, yes. Do you have some time to talk about Eiko's boyfriend? We've got Silky. We're going to rank up. Let's go. Is this rank 7 for Makoto? She's like one behind Yusuke, I think, which is great. It's a national law. Eiko's boyfriend, Tsukasa, has been sending me a lot of text recently. His days and nights are reversed due to his work, so he often sends me a good morning late at night. Does Eiko know about this? Not sure. I'd definitely tell Eiko if he asked me on a date. But for now, things are generally pretty normal. Mostly messages like, how's your BF, and hope you had a great day today. How do you pronounce the words like text talk? Hadoken, my dude, thank you so much for subbing with Twitch Prime for 14 months which is insane thank you so much for the continued support my dude my day is going very good do you think the relationship could actually be serious was i just biased to think that all he wants for mako is her money i definitely think he's suspicious have you seen his hair yes i mean it does sound like a tv show a lying host that tricks women into debt and then forces them to sell their bodies but those kinds of things exist in reality as well immoral hosts human trafficking rings my father even mentioned to me about gangs of men that look specifically for depressed women in Shinjuku. It seems... They take advantage of the loneliness these girls feel to force them into horribly abusive situations. Then after ensuring the girls are buried in crippling debt, they make them sell their bodies to pay it off. There are other ways that they force girls into it as well. Blackmail, illegal immigration. There are countless victims of schemes like that. Countless gangs as well. My father was going after a particularly notorious one when... In the course of his investigation, he was hit by an errant truck. The impact killed him instantly. All right, well, this just got really, really serious. First, it th was thought to be an accident, but at the funeral, I overheard my father's supervisor speaking with my sister. He was saying my father had likely been assassinated. They suspected that the gang he was investigating hired the driver. Who was their leader? 
I don't know. The driver died on impact as well, but apparently they found drugs in his bloodstream. Either way, that gang has been pushed back into the shadows thanks to the Shinjuku cleanup operation. I'm not sure any of that would have happened if not for the incident with my father. He was a noble man. He truly was, wasn't he? Dang it, she's not ready for the next rank. I'm not good at talking to Makoto. <laughs> Wish I could be a little more like him myself. Instead, I've just been hesitant. That's actually why my sister became a prosecutor to begin with. She couldn't stand by and watch as evil prevailed over justice. That passion undoubtedly came from our father. Our mother passed away many years back, so when father was killed, we had to survive on our own. That responsibility, the pressure of that all fell onto my sister. Because of that, she can't help but talk down on our father at times. She says death is no different than surrender. Well, that's literally, like, incredibly scummy. What? I still look up to him. I was often lonely because of how much time he spent at work. But seeing him tirelessly pursue one case after the next was nothing short of incredible. That was how my father chose to live his life. Trying to bring justice and order to the world around him. It's very admirable. Yes. Yeah. Rank up. Let's go. Come to think of it, there was something he used to say to me all the time. The most important part of your life is how you choose to live it. Hmm. How have I chosen to live? And more importantly, how do I want to live? You can figure that out now. I see. Now? You're right. I can still change my path going forward. To be honest, I've been determined to follow the path my sister laid for me. After my father's death, I wanted to lighten the burden on her as much as I possibly could. Oh, we were supposed to be talking about Aiko here. Sorry for going so off topic. Actually... You know, I've never actually talked to anyone about my father. Such a painful memory to look back on. But I feel comfortable discussing it with you. And beyond that, I think I understand my life a bit better now. Thank you very much. So, thank you. Can sense a deep bond of trust from Makoto. Fork it over. Rank 7. Shadow Factorization allows you to see Null, Repel, and Drain when highlighting a target. Very nice. All right. Three ranks to go, boys. Hmm? Oh, it's Heiko. Gloating again. Maybe I'll, like, skip college and just get married to Sukasa instead. Guess she's choosing how she wants to live, too. As long as she's sure, she'll be happy. Oh, another message. Huh? You serious about Kurusukun? Want to have a double wedding? <laughs> Please refuse her. You're right. Right. We need to make sure she doesn't go and reserve her wedding hall for us. Couldn't even begin to think about marriage at this point in my life. By the way, can you keep pretending to be my boyfriend for a bit longer? That's the best method I have of keeping tabs on Eiko and Tsukasa. At any rate, thanks for listening to me today. I'll let you know if anything urgent comes up. All right, then. See you later. I need to, uh... I need to adjust where my mic is. I actually, like... Since I was in a rush, I didn't set my mic up very well, and it's actually a little annoying for me the way I have to crane my head to look at chat. So I need to, like, scoop my mic back a bit. So I'm going to mute for just a second. There you go. That's much better for me. Sorry about that. Hey, do you have time right now? Sorry for venting so much before. I just wanted to talk about Aiko, but I got a little off topic. Thanks for still pretending to be my boyfriend, too. I don't trust Aiko's boyfriend yet, so can we keep this up until I can make a call one way or the other? It's the role I always hoped for. Of course. Thanks. I'm counting on you. Let's see how convincing a boyfriend you can be. I don't. The way you said that, it sounds like you want me to make out with you or something. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Peace out. I don't remember what chapter of FF7R I'm on. I think I'm on, like, 11 or 12. But yeah, let's not talk about it for uh, people in chat who don't want to be spoiled on FF7. I haven't been any mental shutdown cases lately, right? Not since Okumura took first place in the rankings. Perhaps the culprit behind them is being cautious due to the success we've had recently. So it's cause so it's cause of us. Man, I'm glad we're famous. But it's highly probable they'll become active again. Especially if they think the Phantom Thieves aren't actively attempting to do anything. We're also going to be in trouble if we let public opinion go down the path it's heading. 
Yes, there have been a great deal more inst instigating comments lately, and we're all trying so hard. Our inactivity must be upsetting. We should keep that in mind. No crossword. We don't even really need to do crossword anymore because I've maxed out my knowledge. But obviously, I'm going to regardless. Oh, why is not ready for a rank up? You're kidding me. Ah, but we got a catchy. Perfect. Did I, did I use Chihaya today? I think I did, didn't I? I'm going to double check. What's up? Did I already do an affinity I'm reading? Sorry. No, that was the wrong button, but I'm glad that you I'm said no because I didn't want to do that. What shall we do? Have I done this already? Please name on someone you want to become closer with. Oh, apparently I haven't. Well, definitely hit up a Y then. Glad I double checked this. Getting a little worried about our money, but I know it's gonna we're gonna be like back over 300k as soon as I go through Okumura's palace. So like we'll be fine. How far along are you in this? We're currently at the fifth palace, but I haven't done anything in it yet. Other than, like, the default stuff you have to do at the very start. Your feelings should have reached the other person. Thank you. What do you think? Is, uh, is that got OI ready to rank up? Yes, it does. That is tempting, but I do want to rank up Akechi because we have to make sure we get him to eight. I assume by the end of this deadline. By the way, I totally forgot that this deadline says days until Haru is sold off. That's so dark. This game, man. What's up, Akechi? Wait, do I have a justice on me? Hey, Krusukun, good evening. I actually have quite a bit to do. I'm waiting for someone right now, in fact. I'll let you know once I have a little more time. Until then, our battles will have to wait. Oh, I can't hang out with you? Okay, so Akechi is actually gated off right now. Okay. Well, that's fine. I wonder if... He's gated off until the 6th palace because of you-know-what, chat. That would actually make sense. We can't rank up Pafumi. So, yeah, we're actually going to go hang out with a Y. I'm very glad that we were able to get his uh, his stats ready. I need help at the shop. Stop by if you can. I am on my way. <laughs> Everyone has a secret they don't want anyone to know? Barely use a PC? Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to work. Got a security escort task for you. This is something I can only entrust to you. Will you take care of it for me? We got a hangman on us. Let's rank up my boy a Y. Good. Person you'll be escorting is Karu. Get dinner with him at that diner in Shibuya. Now go. I gotta take care of some business with Suda. I'll be there after I handle that. See you soon. You got it. Yeah, I'll be streaming FF7 for four hours tomorrow. I was going to do it today, but I'm getting in a call with my boys tomorrow. We're going to do a top 10 Haikyuu character list tomorrow because we've all finished season... Well, we finished the first half of season 4, and now we have to wait for the second half of season 4 to air. But because I'm getting in a call with them, I wanted to stream FF7 tomorrow so I could do 4 hours so I'd have more time to be in call with them. My dad's really late, huh? He's the one who asked us here, too. You know, it's pretty rare for him to invite people out like this. He must see something in you, Kurusu-san. I doubt he'd ever actually admit it, though. By the way, uh, has he said anything to you about me weighing him down? No, nothing even close to that. To be honest, he's been acting super weird recently. More than anything, he seems stressed out. I've even heard him mentioning my name on the phone a few times. But then every time I've gone to ask him about it, he's told me there's nothing to worry about. I don't know. It just makes me feel anxious somehow. I mean, we're supposed to be a family. I'm not sure if you know this, but... He's not my real father. He just took me in after my parents died in a car crash. Apparently, he was a good friend of theirs. Honestly, I can't remember a single thing about them. I wonder if my dad even considers me to be a part of his family. You should ask him. You're probably right. Now that I think about it, have you ever seen his tattoo? You mean the gecko on his neck? It's really hard. Yeah, gecko on his neck. It's very hard to miss. The truth is, I have a really bad scar in the same spot from my parents' car crash. Back when I was a kid, everyone picked on me for it. My dad would always come home to find me in tears. That's why he got that tattoo. He said it would be the new Awai family crest. Ha, oh, and I did some research on geckos. Turns out they symbolize protecting one's home and family. I'd always forgotten about that, but to be honest, maybe he cares about me more than I realized. I didn't read that sentence right. I had almost forgotten about that, to be honest. Maybe he cares about me more than I realized. Yo. Yo. Sorry for the holdup. You two look like you're having fun. What have you been talking about? 
Talking about girls, man. Like high schoolers do. Well, aren't you two a little pair of lady killers? Guess there are worse things you could be talking about, though. Wait, did you get a girlfriend, Karu? That's not what we were talking about. Sorry. Anyways, I can't stay long. I've got errands I need to take care of. Figured it'd be nicer to at least drop by instead of tell you over the phone. What errands? Or can you not tell me? <sighs> What's that supposed to mean? It's just work stuff. Ain't that right? It's so hard, like... I don't think Awai would appreciate me saying that he should just tell him. It's either right or you should buy us something. This is the the message that is always like, oh, you choose the thing that seems the worst because Awai likes it. But I think in this rare opportunity, I'm just going to agree with Awai and say right. Yeah. Hear that? Just like you said. Dude, I, the other one was probably three notes, but I'll take two notes every time. Okay. By the way, I'm almost done figuring out what happened with that deal we were talking about. I'm going now to meet with the guy who set it all up. I'll have to fill you in on the details some other time. <laughs> Anyways, this is all thanks to you, kid. It's real nice having a reliable part-timer help around the shop. Rank up. All right, four more ranks to go on a Y. We're already at rank six. Wow. That's amazing. We're going to need rank five guts soon. We might even need it now, actually. You're not getting yourself into anything dangerous, are you? Dangerous? Of course not. Later. Well, I'm out of here. You can hang on to my wallet, Kaoru. Eat as much as you want. See you at home. Okay. Kaoru and I ate dinner together. 